The next blood group I'd like to speak to you about is A. And A are the gatherers, because they came much later. So leaning very strongly towards the vegetarian kingdom is very important for A's. And it seems like for the A, when they're calm and peaceful, their ability to make decisions is very good. But A's don't function too well under stress. So faced with a situation where somebody's prodding you and you're in the corner and forced to give an answer, you should always say to that person, I need to think about this. I'll give you my answer tomorrow. Go home, don't think about it, go about your business, go to sleep. During the night while you're sleeping, stress comes off the mind and you awaken with a better answer the next morning. Also two A's tend to lack hydrochloric acid, which is interesting. Their body is incapable of making all the hydrochloric acid they need. So consequently, without hydrochloric acid, there's this difficulty in breaking down animal protein. And that's the reason why A's should lean much stronger towards the vegetarian kingdom. And in an A, a drop of dairy was a poison in their body from the moment of birth. So the more they stay away from dairy, the longer and healthier life they'll have. And A's are very subject to respiratory problems like asthma, sinusitis, circulatory uh, conditions, because mucus in an A, or catarrh in an A, can get caught up into the circulatory system and then put horrendous amounts of stress upon the kidneys, because the kidneys are the great filter of the blood. But when you have excessive mucus in your body, all of that mucus is in the circulatory system, and it's the kidneys that have to filter the blood. I believe the kidneys filter approximately somewhere between 60 to 90 percent of all the blood in our body 60 to 90 times a day. So of course, if an A has lots of milks and cheeses, well certainly that upsets the urinary tract. So leaning towards the vegetarian kingdom, increasing your hydrochloric acid level of your body is an answer for an A.